Hey, what's up, fellas? Welcome back to a new video. Um, I'm just gonna be reacting to this video titled. <sighs> Sorry, I had to swallow my spit. I'm gonna react to this video titled "Customer Shames Fast Food Worker and Instantly Regrets It" by Darman. I'm like, bro, what type of title is this? It's <laughs> I don't know. I I never would have thought that this would be a scenario, but it is. Um, so let me go over to the screen. So this, what I'm gonna do on this channel is react to videos that are on the home page when I'm not signed in. So I opened up an incognito tab and went on the home page, and this one was the first one on the home page. This has 12 million views, and I I want to see why people like this because 319 thousand likes over 6.1 likes. His videos are doing pretty good. Um, I've seen other Darman videos, people react to them. It was it, pretty corny, but let's see what this one is about and let's see if we can get some uh, redemption for his corniness from the past. <laughs> All right, let's go. Welcome to WhatsApp. Why can't I get started for you? Yeah, let me get a 12 inch veggie. Wait, Larry? Larry the loser from high school? <laughs> that escalated quickly, man. <laughs> I, he, he noticed it right away. It's like, wait, Larry? It's like he, there was no pause to think. It just said Larry. I think he already knew he was Larry even before talking to him. I can't believe you work here. How embarrassing. Um. All right, man, you don't have to rub it in. I can't believe you work here. How embarrassing. You didn't even go to college and get a good job, and now you're a loser, and you work at this. <laughs> times have been tough, so... I do what I have to to put food on the table. My man. What do you make here anyway? Like eight bucks an hour? Ooh. Ooh. Almost. Almost. Seven fifty. But my goal is to be a regional manager one day. Wow. Anyways, what are you doing nowadays? Well, I'm a manager for Darman Studios. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you just gotta plug in the Darman Studios in there. Me. Darman, if you have this man, if you're hiring this man, you gotta fire this guy. With the owner a little bit later today, and he is gonna promote me to senior manager. Wow. Hey, congrats. I'm really happy for you. Wish I could say the same to you. <sighs> man, come on, man. Like he 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 complimented you, man, and then you're you're just saying, oh, wish I could say the same thing for you. It's like a backhanded compliment, my guy. You're intentionally trying to make him feel bad because you're in a better place than him. Doesn't seem like things have changed much, have they? Larry the loser. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, here's your food, and that'll be fourteen fifty. By the way, nice uniform there, buddy. You know, one day you might be able to afford a suit and tie like this. Yeah, maybe. Actually, what's going to happen? Is he going to become like a Bitcoin millionaire and that guy's going to become poor? And then they're going to be like, ha, I told you I was going to become a manager in this fast food place. Give me a favor. Smile. Can you please not take pictures of me? Oh, don't be shy. I just want everyone in high school to see what a loser you still are. Really good acting, man. Really good acting. Very convincing. Look at Larry the loser. Yeah, that's that's an instant fire right there. I mean, uh, don't employers check their <laughs> their uh, employees' uh, social media to make sure they're not doing anything sketchy or bad? Sandwich connoisseur. I mean, sandwich connoisseur makes it sound nice. Just say fast food worker. That's a better insult than sandwich connoisseur. Uh, hey, your footer already has 20 likes on it. You know, I would stay and hang out, but I've got a real job to get back to. So, here you go. Yeah, you you can't do that. The trash was right there. It, like it would have take that. It would have took less energy to rub yourself in, man. I already hate this guy already, man. No. Oh no! I have to use the bathroom. Can you get the toilet paper so you can wipe my butt? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Just kidding. I'm not. But I mean, it is your job to clean up the floors, right? 
Dang, this man is living the thug life to 100%. You know what, Todd? You should never look down on someone. Because one day you might end up looking up to them. Yeah, he's gonna like fight him and then he's gonna do a triple kick, drop kick on him. Isn't that ironic? The sandwich artist is trying to give me life advice. You know what, let me do you a favor. Just because this guy works in a studio doesn't mean he doesn't need life advice. There's the tie. Now he's gotta sell enough sandwiches to get the rest of the suit. Larry the loser. I mean, it, that should be pretty easy if he's working. If he works two weeks or something, he'll be able to buy a suit. <laughs> a good suit anyway. Hence, he'll have money left. He's acting as if uh, working in a sandwich shop doesn't give you enough money to live. Todd walks off, leaving Larry behind to clean up all- Who is the narrator? That must be Darman. Darman sounds like he's talking to a mentally disabled child. All the mess. Like, like, listen to that. Walks off, leaving loser. <laughs> Todd walks off. Todd walks off, leaving Larry behind <laughs> to clean up all the mess. Why is he talking like this? Talk normally, my guy. Just say Todd. Uh, Todd walks off, leaving Larry behind to clean up all the mess. Like he just had to read it slowly, like he's drunk or something. <laughs> He ends up attending the meeting with the owner, so excited for the promotion. Oh look, it's Darman. Except? Except he gets fired and he gets shot by 10 people when he walks out. Things don't go exactly as planned. Yeah, his family got killed by the mafia. The <laughs> owner finds out about the Facebook post. Oh, I called that one out. I told you. I told you that would happen. They look at their posts and then they're gonna fire him after that. What did I tell you, man? What did I tell you? And fires Todd on the spot for violating the company bullying policy. Yeah, now he's gonna be poor on the street, living off of uh, begging, and then he's gonna be addicted to drug, and he's gonna go to a, an asylum because he's gonna become insane, and then the fast food worker is gonna own a multi-trillion dollar company and then be flexing on the other guy. That's my, that's my guess. Then after that, he wants revenge. So that means after that, they go into an ultimate battle. So they go in their cars, and then they go in space, and then they shoot lasers at each other. And they maneuver past the asteroids. And then one of them breaks a laser through the asteroids. Okay, sorry. That's my overactive imagination working, man. Is this thing still recording? Cause I'm I gotta make sure it got all that. It is still recording. Okay. Now unemployed, Todd has to look for other jobs, applying everywhere he can. But no matter where he just just the way he sounds when he's narrating it it, it just does it, it fits but his voice is weird over it i don't know he goes no one wants to hire him because of his bad references it's like he's talking slow you know what i mean it's nothing wrong with slow but his voice combined with the slow talking like i said he sounds like he's talking to some type of child or something i don't know after months of being unemployed things get so bad that todd runs out of money Ooh. having Ooh. tried so many other options he decides to swallow his pride and apply at a fast food restaurant oh no and then one day todd happens to run into larry welcome to what's up how can i help you sir um actually i wanted to see if todd larry i i barely recognized you what are you doing in a suit well two weeks ago i got promoted to senior district manager I'm now in charge of 125 locations. <laughs> Dang, man. He's making big bank. Wow, that's that's incredible. Anyways, you want the same thing as last time? The 12-inch? Um, no, um, actually, I came by to see if, see if you guys were hiring. Oh. You see, times have gotten a little tough, and... Uh, and uh, he got fired because he bullied that guy. 
you gotta do to put food on the table. Ooh, isn't that ironic? He's saying the same thing that that guy originally said in the beginning. I, that's that's good character development, man. Are you sure you'd want to work for Larry the Loser? I'm really sorry for what I said to you. Uh, I'm not. He's not. You were right. You should never look down at someone because one day you might be looking up to them. Can you ever forgive me? No. It would be funny if you just said no and the video just ended right there. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Oh, of course he says yeah. There always needs to be a happy ending. Yeah, I, I was expecting, you know what I was expecting? Uh, he was going to say, will you forgive me? And then, no! Pew! Heads get shot off. <laughs> no! <laughs> okay. All right. And actually, I can get you started right away. Come on, I'll show you how to be a sandwich connoisseur. <laughs> hey, Darman fam, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Oh, that is him. Next video. That is him, man. That is Darman. Okay. His I, video, I know you're going to love it. I, I don't know. His voice doesn't fit how he looks like. I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm not used to seeing Darman. But, yeah. Sorry if I paused too much, but this is a reaction. By the way, I'm, I'm assuming you already watched the video. But if you didn't, well, well, watch the video on your own. And I'm switching the camera angles. Woo, 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 woo. You want to see something cool? Uh, no, you don't. I got to. <laughs> well, check out my other videos. I'm going to be reacting to other stuff and stuff. And see you guys later. Peace out, my brothers.